Dear friends and colleagues, what an extraordinary year this has been. The word unprecedented has been used on many an occasion, and I can think of no better word to describe the challenges that we have all faced. But today I want to bring you an update on our plans for the SIOP Europe's second annual meeting. As you know, at the beginning of the year, we were all excited and full of energy to develop the programme for the face-to-face -face meeting in Valencia in May. However, by March 2020, it became evident that the impact of the COVID-19 pandemic was going to make it impossible for us to be able to hold that face-to-face -face meeting. And along with CCI Europe, we made the decision to postpone the meeting to have it again in Valencia, but in April 2021. As we now approach the end of 2020, even with the hope of the vaccines that are being rolled out today, it is evident that the possibility of a face-to-face -face meeting in April 2021 is unlikely. It is probable that social distancing rules will continue and it will be not possible for us to have a large gathering in a closed building and there will continue to be travel restrictions both for work and for personal reasons. So for this reason we have decided to move the annual meeting to be a virtual meeting in April 2021. The meeting will occur in the same week but will extend for only three days from the 28th to the 30th of April. We are working closely with the European clinical trial groups, with Young CIRP and CCI Europe to design a programme that is focused on joint sessions that will bring together the key issues that are facing children and young people with cancer in Europe today. We'll provide a programme that brings the cutting edge, exciting scientific discoveries as well as outputs from clinical trials and have debates to discuss how to implement the best treatments to improve outcomes for children and young people with cancer. The meeting will also provide training and mentorship for our young doctors and fellows who are our future. We want to make this meeting as accessible as possible and for this reason we have tried to bring the registration fee down as much as is feasible. There will be special rates for CIP members, CCI Europe members, for young CIRP so that the young doctors, the parents, the patients, survivors and nurses can all attend the meeting along with CIRP members for the lowest fee possible. I'm delighted to say the registration will open in January and there will be more information to follow. This year the meeting will not be per invitation only but will be open to all who have an interest in the care, management and research of children and young people with cancer and we hope that as many of you as possible will register and participate in the meeting. I would like to thank you all again for your support during this unprecedented year. Despite the challenges, the paediatric oncology community, community are ready to get together and meet to chain, exchange ideas, knowledge and expertise. And we really hope that as many of you as possible will support this meeting. I would like to take this opportunity to thank you on behalf of the SIAP Europe Board and the SIAP Europe Office for all your support and encouragement over the last year. And I wish you all a very safe, happy and restful holiday season and look forward to seeing as many of you as possible at the virtual meeting in 2021.